Scanning pools are useful if you ever need to limit which scanning machines can scan certain sites. You may wish to keep scanning machines and the sites they scan to the same geographic areas, for example. Or some sites might only be available to scan by scanning machines on the same network. Scanning pools stop the problem of a scan failing because the relevant machine is busy elsewhere, or an assigned machine is unable to handle a restricted site for a scan. Some example uses for scanning pools are keeping the scanning machines in sites for one geographic area together, cordoning off the resources for one team, scanning sites with restricted access, and reserving scanning machines for specific purposes, such as CI-CD pipelines or ad hoc scanning. Each scanning machine and site is assigned to a pool. The important features of scanning pools are each scanning machine must belong to a scanning pool, each site to be scanned must belong to a scanning pool, and only scanning machines in the same pool as a site can scan that site. To create a new scanning pool, do the following. From the settings menu, select scanning machines, click on the scanning pools tab, select create pool, provide a name and description for the new scanning pool, assign the relevant scanning machines and sites to the new pool, and then click save. To reassign an existing scanning machine to a different pool, do the following. From the settings menu, select scanning machines. Make sure you are on the scanning machines tab. In the list of scanning machines, select the relevant drop down menu for the scanning machine you want to reassign and click on the name of the scanning pool to place it in that pool. To reassign an existing site to a different scanning pool, do the following. Click on the Sites tab, select the relevant site, click on the Details tab, click Edit, click on the Scanning Pool drop-down and select the scanning pool you want the site to move to, then click Save.